It's just kind of one of those things where I think it's a need. After four years of discussion, the Grants Pass School District is putting a bond on the May ballot. Now it's up to the voters to decide if they want to foot the bill to construct two new middle schools and upgrade current facilities to be ADA compliant with central heat and AC. Anyone who's passionate about kids and kids' futures, I, I don't see why you wouldn't be passionate about making sure that this bond passes. Michelle Dietz is the mother of three. I have a fifth grader, a seventh grader, and a sophomore. Here. She says the improvements are vital to student health. Well, no one wants to go into a hot, stuffy, um, outdated you know, facility. At one of our elementary schools, she'll say it gets to like 55 degrees in her classroom sometimes, and that's just not acceptable. I mean, it's you wouldn't want to come to your job and freeze, so why are we asking our kids to do it? Deeds attended Tuesday's informational meeting to learn about the issue and spread the word to neighbors. So I can help be a voice and help support um, something that me and my family feel very passionate about getting past. The proposed bond would cost homeowners $1.94 per thousand dollars of assessed value on their home over a 30-year period. While the price tag may be high, Deed says it'll pay off in the long run. You know, don't look at it as a number. You look at it as an investment in our kids' future.